How you living? What? How you living? What? How you living? Can't live in color. applause there. Uh, gets me real excited. Makes me so excited my voice goes real high. <laughs> you know, tonight we have a really similar show for you, but why don't we start out by introducing you to Bradford Marcellus and the Tonight Show Band. <laughs> Let's get right to the news. Here's some of the headlines that are happening around our country. People are sending them to us. First headline, crazed gunman mows down 15 in post office. <laughs> Aren't these people taking this Elvis stamp thing a little too seriously? <laughs> All right. Second headline says bank robbed, four security guards killed. And well worth the 335 an hour, I must say. <laughs> Anyway, let's get started. My first guest is the first bald person to win a Grammy since Isaac Hayes. Please welcome Sinead O'Connor. Come on out here, Sinead. All right, hey, Sinead, let's rise for the singing of our national anthem, huh? Didn't you? Okay. That's good you can take a joke like that. I guess uh, it's good to see you again. I guess the lesson for the uh, l young girls out here is that uh, you should never use the drive through window at Supercuts. Oh, it's very funny, Mr. Leno, make your jokes. But I'm not a girl, you know, I'm a woman. This is just a sort of sexist attitude I dealt with all my life. Even in my own homeland of Ireland where a grown woman is called a lassie. Lassie, huh? You look more like a Mexican heiress to me, <laughs> Uncle Fester. You know, make your little jokes, Mr. Leno, but I'm not here on your show to promote my career. This is capitalist business, that's what this is. This is the Prime Minister of Norway. Her country allows the killing of thousands of whales. You know, I went whale watching once. I heard the captain yell, there she blows, and I thought somebody had spotted Madonna. <laughs> now, what has this cute little guy done to deplete whatever? Nothing, but I just find him really irritated. Well, I got one for you, Mrs. Clean. Yeah, this one up. No, our senor is a fine man and very politically correct. You know, when we were dating, dating. you would often say it Dating? Me. You were dating Arsenio Holmes? Yes, what of it? You have fallen from grace. You are no longer invited on this show. You have slept with the anti-host. Can you imagine if she and Arsenio had a kid with her bald head and his triangle head? He'd come out looking like a yield sign with a nose ring. Like this. Yeah, why don't you go 
join a karate class. See if they can snatch the pebble from your hand, huh? Okay, we're gonna take a short commercial break here and be right back. Hey, hold on. Hold on here. Wait a second. What happened to Branford and the band? Oh, snap. They had to run off early. They had to do the Arsenio Hall show. <laughs> well, that's it. They're banned. They're banned. The band is banned. I don't care. I don't need them anyway. I don't. As long as I still have my audience, right? <laughs> If you can't beat them, you might as well get busy with some of that Dorito eating, controversy ducking, motorcycle riding, producer firing, Johnny should have stayed funk. Ah! Hi, I'm Cher, singer, actress, mother, model, slut. <laughs> And you're probably wondering what I'm doing hawking beauty products when everyone knows my face has seen more cuts than a Thanksgiving turkey. Well, I make goo gobs of money doing this. And I'm Laurie Davis. And you're wondering how someone who looks like this could possibly have something to say about beauty. You see, there were days when I didn't feel good about how I looked, no matter how many young men I had around me. But then I found out about the credible beauty system of Laurie Davis and realized money was more important than grinding a Boy Scout. <laughs> Lori, I used your product for over a year before I realized that it wasn't your product at all. It was merely being around you that made me look so great. Exactly, Cher. That's the secret of beauty, you see. It isn't so much looking good yourself, but rather sitting next to someone who can't help but make you look good by, By comparison. comparison. <laughs> All of a sudden, I feel light as a feather and rich, too. And your hair even looks better. <laughs> but, Lori, what about all the millions of people that purchase your products that don't have the benefit of being next to you? Well, that's what makes my system so special. They can find an unattractive person of their own. <laughs> At DMV... Kmart, Weight Watchers, or any of the Slavic countries. <laughs> Lori, this is fun. Now, let's hear from another satisfied customer. This is my best friend, Chelsea. Hi, Chelsea. Hi. Chelsea, why did you agree to participate in this commercial? Because your perfume's not selling. And you said we had to do this. <laughs> Read the cue card, honey. Oh. Because I wanted to feel better about myself, and the Lori Davis hair care system is the product that can help. Having tried the products, how do you feel? Okay, I guess. Now go sit by Lori. <laughs> wow, I feel great. <laughs> is that me? I look beautiful. You sure do, Chelsea. <laughs> See, what my system can do for you, and it can do that for anybody. <laughs> Janie, come over here. Come on over here, Janie. <laughs> oh, come to mommy. <laughs> it does work. I'm going to buy the Lori Davis hair care system today. <laughs> hey, guys, you don't have to be left out either. Oh. Hey, I feel beautiful. And you can too. The Lori Davis Beauty System. Because there is always someone uglier. You look good. Because I don't. <laughs> Hi, I'm George Hamilton. Throughout my illustrious career, I have been frequently complimented about my golden bronze pigment. You see, with a little help from that hole in the ozone, over the years, my epidermal layer has gotten so thick and leathery that, quite frankly, it's as dead as my career. That's why today I'm offering directly to you the George Hamilton Luggage Collection. How do I know it's good? Because it's made out of my skin. 
Let my loss of elasticity become your key to durability. There's never a need to worry about those clumsy baggage handlers. Uh-oh. It took me 50 years of loafing around the pool to build. <laughs> Give me your best shot, Primate. Order now and you'll get these matching rump hide belts. The next time someone asks you if you know George Hamilton, you can say, Know him? I beat my kids with him. Order your collection now. police show are John Winsfield and Jake and the Fat Man. They <laughs> need to know, man. Oh! 
thank you. Uh, naturally, this makes up for all of the studying I've done. I mean, those four years at Harvard, two years at Yale, and my six years at Stratford. I'd just like to say that it all paid off in that one role I played in Hunter. The thug next to the water fountain. Well, I'd just like to say thank you. All right, and now to present our next award, put your hands together for two of TV's hottest talents. I know you're going to love these brothers. Please welcome Lenny Johnson, star Gimme Five, and my man Louis Bedford, star Slap Me Some Skin. Gimme Five, Slap Me Some Skin, bro. <laughs> Just so everybody knows, Louie here is throwing a big party at his house, and everybody's invited. What you talking about, lady? <laughs> and the nominees for Best Black Actress are... Whoopi Goldberg, Star Trek The Next Generation. <laughs> Whoopi Goldberg, HBO Comic Relief. <laughs> Sister Act. <laughs> and uh, Wabi Goldberg Serafina. <laughs> and the Pookie goes to Whoopi Goldberg for Sister Act. Wow, uh, this is such a big surprise. I mean, um, uh, my competition was so tough. You know, I, I can't believe this. You know, I, I give myself a Jewish name and, and you criticize me. I marry a white guy and you dog me. I make a movie in South Africa and you hate me. Now you're giving me this award that's getting my hands all greasy. What the hell is wrong with you people? Yeah. Hold up, hold up, hold up, baby. You got that in all you win in the dishes, you get the new super cone. <laughs> The black people the war. The black black people the war. You went, I went, she went, he went. And the black people the war. Good night, everybody. Good night. Tonight's special guest is new on the scene, and he's definitely hot. His name is Adorn. He's straight off the Atlantic Records. Here he is singing, Let It All Hang Out. Yes, I live in color. It's time to get out your seats. Come on, come on. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Straight from New York City to Big Apple. I know you want to bite, but we got DJ ADF on the one and two. Got to be Adorn dancers. We about to let it all hang out. So follow me. Come on. Here he comes, here he comes, here he comes. Yo, pumping that fuel for all to use. Yo, we're getting buck wild on this ATOR slamming crew. Stepping up to boom rush the stage. He's the crew motivated by the spark of the rage. The mic is the teacher to get you out the cage. From the get go, the critics ranted and raved. The hip hop was too strong. The road to the riches we began to pay. Where the body, mind, soul become one. Put your hands like this, yo. And come I'm still in the Cause the message is loud and clear. The all to hear and make the crowd cheer. For this is the season of the year. The flow, a two will run a kind of tip. But we want this all be It's time to let yourself go. It's time to get you off of this naughty delic tip. I'm not a hippie, but yo, B, I'm here. Yeah. Naughty delic definition. No more self doubt. Future on point. My brother's gonna work it out. Pressure gets high, stay the mind is in the power. Come on, Flip come on. The vibes, come on. Tim Dog, get it, boy. Get your arm all night long. It feels too right, too strong to be wrong. Turn it up, full blast, and make it last. Your 
I think about the future, forget the past. With the beat is pumping, to get the people jumping, to saying something. Do you know what I'm talking about when I tell you to express yourself? Come on, let it all hang out. Yeah, yeah, cause we got what you like. Come on, come on, let it all hang out. Yeah, cause we got what you like. Come on, come on, let it all hang out. Just throw your hands in the air And wave them like you just don't care And if you're ready, you're ready And if you're ready, you're ready And if you're ready, you're ready, you're ready, you're ready, you're ready, you're ready. And if you're ready to rock with the ADOR Somebody sing, everybody sing And let the colors sing, oh yeah Come on, come on